Aloha from Oahu. I'm Devin. And I'm Esme, and we're the Rise and Drive Morning Show on 94.7 Kumu. Mahalo to Kiahi and Kahanu. They're the grandsons of Kumuhula Carl Vito Baker and the sons of Kumuhula Kaena Hopkins. That chant is about mahalo, which means thanks and gratitude. And that's the purpose of our program, Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. We're here to thank our healthcare heroes for working so hard and making so many sacrifices to keep our community safe. Now to do that, we have some of Hawaii's most beloved musical artists. But first, a message from our Lieutenant Governor, Josh Green. Aloha everyone. My name is Josh Green, your Lieutenant Governor. I wanted to say thank you. Thank you to our first responders, our nurses and doctors and medics. You have done incredible things through this COVID crisis. Did you know that we have the second lowest mortality rate in the whole country? We've lost 10 of our loved ones here in the state and every other state except for Wyoming has seen larger death, more suffering. It's just incredible what you've done. I think of the stories where people who are medics go out and they resuscitate an individual knowing full well that they might be catching COVID themselves. The firefighters and police out there on the front lines nurses gearing up every day. When I do my ER shifts, I see them. I see their commitment, the long hours, and we all know that 10 to 20% of all COVID cases are in our healthcare profession. It's just incredible what you've done. You've saved lives, you've given us confidence. I can't tell you how much we thank you here at our office and all across the state. This could go on for a while, but we know that we have confidence in you. We have confidence that you're professional, that you're clear thinking, that you're compassionate. Hawaii has really made us proud when we look at our healthcare workers. So thanks again for all that you do. Keep doing it. We're going to get through this together. I really love you guys. A big mahalo to Lieutenant Governor Josh Green for that message and to our hardworking healthcare workers during this unprecedented time. Aloha, I'm Kanoi Gibson with Hi Now. Thank you for joining us as we partner with Pacific Media Group in honoring our healthcare heroes. Throughout the show, you'll be seeing performances from some of Hawaii's most beloved performers as they express their aloha for our local heroes through music. Over the past couple of months, we have seen our communities come together in support of those fighting on the front lines in hospitals, testing sites and medical centers, just to name a few. Here's a look at some of the support you've extended as Hawaii News Now's Jim Mendoza gives us an inside look at the food donations being made to various healthcare workers across the islands. The grill at Teddy's Bigger Burger was firing on all cylinders this morning. The small business cooked up a special order for the Queens Medical Center. We're bringing 100 burgers, fries, and uh, bottles of water. Teddy's donated the food and drink to Queens staff working the front lines in the fight against the coronavirus. It was the burger maker's way of saying thank you. Well, everyone else is, you know, in quarantine and, you know, they're staying at home and these are the guys that have to risk their lives every single day and, uh, you know, why not treat our heroes really good? and at least make them happy for a, a, a lunch. Like others caring for pandemic patients, Queens has deservedly seen a lot of aloha. Gifts of food have been pouring in to the hospital system's employees. Every day, they're taking care of this at-risk population, and sometimes it's easy to get kind of lost in what the work that you're doing. The aloha spirit is alive and well, and we love it. Armstrong Produce donated thousands of pounds of produce to Queens workers. Plus, there have been donations from Pizza Hut, Ted's Bakery, Marion's Catering, and many others. And the generosity has been statewide. Our Queens West uh, Hospital has received donations there as well, North Hawaii Community Hospital, and even Molokai. Um, so we want to just extend the aloha to all the people that are thinking about us. Teddy's made the donation despite a severe downturn in its business. The staff felt it was important to show their appreciation. We were really excited to team up with them and uh, we're hoping to keep going and do it again somewhere else too. Jim Mendoza, Hawaii News Now. Now remember, all of the performances you see tonight have been self-shot by the artists, including the ones that we're doing right now. Our first artist is an award-winning slack key guitar player, singer, and composer. With a song that he wrote just for this program. Next up, we welcome Makana. Aloha Kako. The song I'm about to play for you was inspired by the many truly essential people sustaining our collective well-being as the rest of us shelter safely at home. They are at a greater risk, none so much as our frontline healthcare workers. Thank you for your commitment and your sacrifice. You deserve better. Where would 
we be without the people we can see? The ones who make life so much easier for people like you and me. I've been sitting in my home now for three weeks straight. I know that every one of you can totally relate. It's so easy to feel like the world has stopped, but there's a whole lot of people making sure that we got everything we're gonna need just to get us through. But there's a lot that needs to meet so many jobs to do. We need the farmers, the pickers, the drivers and the stalkers, the cashiers, the shippers, Pilots and the dockers, the garbage collectors, postal service sector, the many volunteers who help the food bags and the shelters, the restaurants still making our food fall to taking, and the people who keep the water and power on, cause I like baking. My mood is gratitude. Ooh, 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 ooh. My mood is gratitude. to go to work in a place where the deadliest of viruses lurks. Then imagine not having protective gear where there's no need to imagine because we're already here. When I see nurses wearing trash bags and Halloween masks, doctors covering their faces with some plastic trash. I can't help but be in wonder at the sacrifice of the people on the front lines who are paying the price. To all the nurses, the doctors, the respiratory therapists, the midwives, the counselors, home care providers, staff of the hospitals around the world, from the janitors and cooks to the admissions ward, to all the pharmacists, social workers, mental health too, the emergency responders. Big thanks to you, my mood is gratitude. Where would we be without the people we can't see? The ones who make life so much easier people like you and me. Take care of each other, Hawaii. Aloha. Aloha. I'm Ray Vera, President and CEO of Hawaii Pacific Health. And I just wanted to say thank you, certainly to the performers who put on this Hale to Hale uh, performance, um, but most importantly, uh, to the people of Hawaii Pacific Health and healthcare providers around our community. Thank you so much for the impact that you're making and the work that you're doing in the lives of our patients um, and their families and around the community during this critical time. We've done a tremendous amount of work in standing up new testing sites, evaluation centers, protecting um, both our staff and our patients at every step of this process. And your work is clearly work worth doing. Thank you to all of our physicians, staff, and everyone around the healthcare community for all the work that you've done uh, tremendous work, frankly, during this critical time. Aloha. Aloha mai kako. I'm Napua Greg, and we come together to give our great, great mahalo, our gratitude to all of our first responders and healthcare workers here in Hawaii. We understand that you sacrifice your time with your family and even being together with your families and loved ones so that you can serve our greater community. And for that, we are so, so thankful. Mahalo nui. You are watching Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. We will be right back.
Aloha, I'm Crystal Lakana from Oahu on High 93 Oahu on 93.1, 2 to 7 p.m. weekdays and on 94.7 Kumu weeknights on the Kumu Quiet Storm. There's so many things that has changed in the past month, but if there's one thing that hasn't changed, it is the love of our healthcare workers. They continue to run in and to help others while we're at home and scared of what's happening. And we just wanna say that we appreciate all that you're doing for us. Oh, I got chicken skin. And especially thank you to your families who sacrificed you being away. I know how that feels. So I really, really appreciate you. To our listeners, thank you so much for being here tonight. What brings us together is our love of music. That is our universal connection is music. Tonight, this artist, he is an award-winning guitarist, vocalist, composer, and producer. He does it all, Mr. Fish and Poi himself. Here's Sean Na'awal with the medley. Aloha, this is Sean Na'awal. First off, I'd like to say a big mahalo to all of our healthcare heroes for putting their lives on the line to keep us safe here at home. So once again, we'd like to say a big, big mahalo to all of our healthcare heroes. And here's a couple of songs for you all. Stay safe, everybody. Hi, my name is Trisha Medeiros and I'm the Chief Operating Officer for the Plaza Assisted Living. I'd like to first thank all the team members at the Plaza. They've truly stepped up and protected our residents during this unprecedented pandemic. They displayed the flexibility needed for rapidly changing policies. They treated every resident like a friend. And when we implemented our no visitor policy, that's exactly what was needed, a friend, a best friend. 
I've worked in healthcare for 25 years and have never felt the deep appreciation I have for the team in these past months. Thank you. Next, I'd like to thank the first responders and fellow healthcare professionals for their grit to go out every day and battle COVID-19. A hero is somebody who puts themselves in danger for another. They are truly healthcare heroes. Finally, I'd like to thank everybody at home for staying at home. That's exactly what our residents need. How's it from Maui? I'm Kavika Vika, daybreak morning host, 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. weekdays on High 92. You know, during these COVID-19 pandemic times, there's a lot of uncertainty out there. Well, what is certain and what we can trust is the diligence, hard work, and commitment of our Hawaii healthcare workers, first responders, and those providing essential business needs. We thank you from the bottom of our hearts. On top of that, we'd also like to thank the family members of these wonderful individuals for understanding when they put themselves on the line, they also put their family members on the line. And we thank them for their bravery as well. At this time, we would like to introduce a well-known Maui girl. We call her our Maui idol, Miss Roots Girl herself. She doesn't know what to do when the dub stops, but she does know what to do when it comes to playing that good vibe. Please welcome Ellie Mack. Aloha everyone, my name is Ellie Mack and this is Mr. Louis Castle here. We just wanted to make a little video and send you guys some love, especially to our first responders out there. Thank you guys so much for all your hard work and dedication and for still having to work in this crazy COVID world. Thank you for being there for everyone. Um, to everybody at home, please stay at home. Please wash your hands, drink your water, take your vitamins, keep it so fresh and so clean, clean. Wear your mask, all that good stuff. Everybody, we wish you the best. We're just sending all of our love and all of our good vibes. And uh, we're gonna sing a song for you. This is a song that I wrote a couple years back. This song is called First Love. One, two, do, do, do.
Hi, I'm Ron Vance, Regional President of Kaiser in Hawaii. I'd like to tell you a quick story that's nothing short of extraordinary. For several weeks, we've been caring for a critically ill great-grandmother of 80 who tested positive for COVID-19 and was in our intensive care unit. A couple of days ago, we were able to send her home to her family, recovered and healthy. And as she was wheeled out into the lobby of our hospital, she was met with a standing ovation from our medical staff. For me, that tells you everything you need to know about the work our healthcare heroes are doing in this crisis. Day in and day out, the medical staff at Kaiser Permanente put their heart and soul into every patient, young or old. Our caregivers don't just believe in miracles, they fight for them, and they make them happen. From the nurses, to the physicians, to the environmental services staff, they're standing side by side, working tirelessly together to get us through this. And no matter how many times we say thank you, it doesn't even begin to describe the appreciation we have for all of our healthcare heroes. We're in awe of you, and we will be eternally grateful. Aloha my kako, I'm Kuana. And I'm Tehani. And let's all stay home for our healthcare heroes. Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. Ron Wiley for you from Kauai, Kauai's Kong. Mahalo to our heroes, the real heroes, the phenomenal heroes, our healthcare worker heroes risking their health for us. Now, what are we doing here on Kauai? People are staying healthy, that's it, and staying at home. And whenever you can show personal love, you know the person themselves, let them know. Tell them all of Kauai truly appreciates what they do for us. And we have some great performers coming up. Now this duo has been together since 2011. They have multiple awards between the two of them. Listen, wide ranges of music styles, Lehua Kalima and Sean Pimentel. Aloha everyone. We just want to say mahalo to all of our first responders, our nurses, our doctors, administrators out there helping during this pandemic um, to keep all of Hawaii safe. We really appreciate all the things that you've been doing for us, so mahalo nui.
Kauai. I'm Lexi Jones from High 95 Kauai at 95.9 FM on your weekday afternoons. Now I'm very excited to be with you to share music from Hale to Hale for our Hawaii healthcare heroes. Whew, we got a show in store for you. Most importantly, we're also here to send out a big mahalo to our Kauai healthcare heroes, to all first responders, and to the families who have shared their loved ones with us to protect us. Mahalo Nui Loa. I'm also here to remind you to be sure to wash your hands and definitely stay home to protect our healthcare heroes and to keep it right here so we can enjoy music all together. I'm very excited and honored to announce that I do have a special message for you from our Senator Maisie Hirono. Aloha, this is Senator Maisie Hirono. I want to add my thanks to all of our health heroes and our first responders who are out there literally risking your lives every day to take care of your patients and, uh, and literally to, to give them the kind of care that they, they need and deserve. But you know, you are risking your lives and we thank you. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I know that many of you also face the concern of going back to your families having been, been exposed to the COVID patients that you're taking care of. And so you have that added concern uh, regarding your family and that's uh, um, also very stressful. Uh, now more than ever, we want to extend our aloha and appreciation for what you do every single day to make sure that people in our community are getting the health care and the care that they need. Much mahalo to each and every one of you. I'm Jill Hogarth Green, and I have the privilege to be the CEO at Queens Health System. I have really been impressed with the quality of care and the compassion that has been provided throughout all of our caregivers and all of our health systems. Working together, you have created a safety net for all of us and our families. Mahalo. We also have many, many people supporting us in our community. I've been touched by the stories that are happening at all of our health systems. We had one recently where three triplets came and brought beautiful cards that they handmade because they were born at Queens and wanted to make sure that all the Queens Ohana was cared for. The gratitude from many, whether they're donating masks that we need or whether they're donating resources that they need, they've all been here supporting us. And our congressional delegation have been particularly focused on us. And I wanna personally thank them for the work at helping us get the appropriate supplies and resources that we need to continue this great work. To our Queens Ohana on a daily basis, I am touched by your creativity, your compassion, and your courage. You have the courage of Queen Emma, and our community is indebted to you. Mahalo. Mahalo. We're in this together. Support healthcare workers by staying inside. You're watching Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. We will be right back.
Aloha from Maui Akama. I'm the Hawaiian homeboy, Shane Kahalehao from KPOA 93.5, extending a huge mahalo to all of our healthcare workers across the state, those on the front line, and we here in Maui doing our part, trying our best to do our part to curb this COVID-19 virus. So on behalf of all of us here on Maui, thank you for doing your part, Hawaii. As our healthcare workers are doing their best, we ask you to do the same and comply by the guidelines that is provided by our leaders of this great state. We too truly miss the Hawaiian music performances by many of our artists as we are very used to, to seeing it live. But continue to do your part as we will definitely be doing ours. This next performer is a very, very good friend of mine. She's a sister of mine. She was my partner here on the Aloha Morning Show on KPOA, born and raised here on the island of Maui, multiple Nahoku Hanohana Award winner and award-winning kumuhula. Ladies and gentlemen, enjoy the talent, the music, the lovely voice of Napua Greg.
and that was a beautiful performance by Napua. If you've just joined us, mahalo for tuning in as we celebrate our healthcare heroes. These men and women are putting their lives on the line every single day. We too can kokua or help in the fight against COVID-19. Remember, you have the power to flatten the curve by staying home. If you do need to go out, wear a mask when leaving the house and continue to practice social distancing. By taking these simple precautions, we can all work together to show our appreciation for our healthcare heroes. We're all in this together and it will take all of us to Kokua. Now let's take a look at a story from Hawaii News Now's Mahelani Richardson about a dedicated team working to provide masks to the community. You got me like a puppet on a string. Lenny Sills of the Kiki Department created this TikTok video featuring 18 small shop owners who are making face masks. Sills says they collaborated on a working list of donation sites for those on the front lines and essential workers. So far, the team of mask makers have collectively donated 8,350 masks and counting, and also 2,500 mask hooks. And we wanted to say a big mahalo to them for helping to keep us safe. And if you have a good news story that you would like to share with us, tag us on social media or email us at news at hawaiinewsnow.com. Welcome back to Hale to Hale. I'm Devin. And I'm Esby from 94.7 Kumu, the Rise and Drive Morning Show. Now our main goal today with Hale to Hale are to thank our healthcare heroes. And to recognize the families of our healthcare heroes. And to remind viewers to follow the statewide efforts and stay at home. We want to say mahalo to all of our musicians who, by the way, self-shot all of their performances. Next, we welcome Kelly Boy Delima and his daughter Lilo. From one of Hawaii's favorite musical acts, Kapena. Aloha, we're Kapena, and thank you to our healthcare heroes. We're never gonna give you up, no matter what nobody say, no. You promised me, you never leave me. I'm never gonna give you up, no matter what your papa say, no. You promised me. everyone. Life as we know it in Hawaii is very different right now than what it was even just a few weeks ago. We are missing our friends, our family, especially our kupuna. Our day-to-day -day routines of school and work have changed completely and so many have lost their jobs and are facing great challenges. But our healthcare heroes, many of whom are facing these very same challenges, keep going to work day after day to make sure that those who need help get the care that they need. So to our healthcare heroes, to our first responders, our essential workers, and the families who are supporting them during these surreal and chaotic times, mahalo. Your service and sacrifice is truly saving lives. 
For everyone else, let's stay home. Follow the guidelines, stay healthy, flatten the curve. We owe it to each other and to our healthcare heroes to stand as one, to stand for each other and beat this virus together. Mahalo to all of you for all that you do. Mahalo nui loa to all the awesome associates of Kahalo Nui for going the extra mile to keep our residents safe, healthy, and happy during this difficult time. We truly appreciate your outstanding work, your compassion, and your dedication to the well-being of our residents. We are proud of how you responded to the current situation and your willingness to make so many changes in such a short period of time. You're doing a great job. Please keep up the good work. We'll get through this soon. Thank you very much. To all of our healthcare professionals, thank you for your commitment and sacrifice. You deserve better. Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. We will be right back. Aloha nui kako, mai ke ia moku nei o moku o ki awe. Aloha mai. Yep, aloha. I'm Jazz, this is Kael. We're from the Bolo Headed Babe Show from Kapa Hawaiian FM at 100.3 and 99.1 and of course online at kaparadio.com. We just want to remind everybody to stay home and follow the state's orders and be safe. And a special mahalo to our healthcare workers as well. Yeah, all of you who are staying open to provide services for other folks who uh, also run essential businesses, we appreciate you so much. So we are going to entertain you with some beautiful music with from all of our islands, all islands are represented and we are just so happy to be part of the Pacific Media Group and this Ohana and share with you some great music. So what we'd like to do for you is introduce a very good friend of ours from Moko Okeave, multi Hoku Award winner, Mr. Kuana Torres Kahele. Aloha my kako, I'm Kuana. And I'm Tihani. We want to send out a big mahalo and aloha to all of our healthcare heroes. Mahalo.
Mahalo to all of our healthcare workers. If we abide by the rules and we stay home, then the quicker we can get through this together and we can avoid putting our healthcare workers at risk. Thank you to all of our performers who shot their videos. It is so unique to see all the different locations and it is beautiful what music can do for us. Lift up our spirits, put a smile on our face, remember old memories with our family and friends when we used to gather together. So I am so grateful for the gift of music that God has given to us. This next performer, she is a ukulele virtuoso and composer. She can play classical to rock to flamenco on ukulele and a wide array of genres. Here is Taimane. Aloha, I wanted to send out a huge mahalo to our first responders and also our healthcare heroes who are keeping us safe and healthy. This song is a Brada Is medley of White Sandy Beach and Somewhere Over the Rainbow. During this public health crisis, I want to thank our healthcare heroes on the front line who risk their own safety every day to provide care to those most in need. They are not only heroes, but superheroes. And they may not wear capes, but they wear masks and gloves and sometimes face shields. Dr. Christina Wang is the medical director of the Hawaii Health and Harm Reduction Center. Her and her fearless team, JP, Raymond, and Courtney, work with some of the most vulnerable for COVID, those that are homeless, struggling with behavioral health, and living with HIV. They and every healthcare hero are going above and beyond. Most recently, our team has worked with the TQIC, the Temporary Quarantine and Isolation Center, that will have a place for those that are homeless to shelter in place if they have COVID or are waiting for results. 
We are so grateful for them and all the healthcare heroes working tirelessly to support our most vulnerable in Hawaii. Mahalo to these superheroes, these mass crusaders on the front line who are saving lives every day in Hawaii. Hello, you guys. Tavana McMore checking in here, uh, sending a big love and aloha to our healthcare heroes out there on the front lines doing what they gotta do to keep us all safe. So, uh, you guys, let's uh, let's all stay home. Let's stay put. Let's, um, let's do what we gotta do to do our part to uh, keep everyone else safe as well. Okay? Thanks so much. Aloha. You're watching Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. Aloha from Oahu. Uh, my name is Steezy. And I'm Rella. We are the morning high on the new High 93. Hawaii's local hits. And we'd like to welcome you back to Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. And we want to mahalo to all our healthcare heroes for staying on the front line and keeping us alive out there. That's right. There's thousands of people who are sacrificing for our communities and being kept from their families just to help us through this pandemic. All right, we wanna remind all of you uh, that all of our performers here today are self-shooting these videos at home. They're instant movie producers right now. Yes, they and they're are. doing a fantastic job. Mm -hmm. And our next performer is a multiple award-winning musician, Grammy Award-winning, and is a household name. Please welcome John Cruz. John Cruz! getting dizzy. You're gonna get dizzy. Oh, I got dizzy. Don't throw up on oh, me. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> Hello. It's John Cruz from my Hale to your Hale. Actually, he's downstairs from my Hale. But um, I'd like to send this song uh, particularly out to all our healthcare heroes out there on the front line. All right? Prayer for a friend. Give 
what we can in the end in a bed for a friend. I want you near me or dear to me. The future is ours, it's so clear to me. I want you near me. Ours, it's so clear to me. Leaving you, leaving could somehow tear us apart. Deep in my heart, I know you're a part of me. Prayer for a friend, hope I see you again in our lives. We need someone to hold and confide in. I see you again. Pray for and hope I see you again. Pray for a friend. See you guys after this is all over. Aloha. Mahalo to John Cruz for that performance of Prayer for a Friend. All of the entertainment you're seeing tonight has been shot by the performers themselves as they bless us with their musical gift and special messages. We'd like to extend a big mahalo to each and every one of them and to all of you for tuning in. But the greatest appreciation tonight goes to our healthcare heroes and their families who are sacrificing so much in this time to take care of our loved ones. Thank you to all of you in the community who are banding together to show your love and aloha for them as well. What a beautiful thing it is when Hawaii comes together and we are known to do so in the hardest of times. Hawaii News Now Stephanie Lum shows us an example of just that. Take a look. A special delivery for paramedics, EMTs, and dispatchers today. Peter Eldridge and Tom Jones of Rainer Hawaii Overhead Doors donated lunch bentos from Gyotaku Japanese Restaurant. They wanted to thank those who were responding to calls every day. And the Office of Hawaiian Affairs is helping to feed kupuna during the pandemic through the Kaya Ulu Meals program today. The program provides $450,000 to organizations across the state that are feeding kupuna in need. That money will help those groups feed nearly 1,500 kupuna over the next three months. The food will be sourced from local farms. Hello, Ron Wiley on Kauai for Kong Radio again and for the people of Kauai, we love and appreciate and adore our healthcare heroes. And what can we do, each and every one of us? Well, we can stay healthy. We can stay at home as much as possible. We can wear, when we get out, we can wear the nose and mouth cover six feet apart, all of that, it's extremely, it's vitally important as we continue to stay healthy for the benefit of our healthcare workers who are risking their lives. Mahalo to the healthcare workers, mahalo to our entertainers. We have an international singer-songwriter. She played roles in Miss Saigon, Germany, The Lion King, Hong Kong, The King and I, and she's also a vocal coach, Christian Lay. Aloha. I'm Christian Lay, and I'm so grateful to be a part of this concert that honors our healthcare providers. 
Thank you to everyone who's staying at home in order to flatten the curve. I encourage all of you to stay strong, productive, and positive as we continue on in this historical endeavor as citizens of humanity. I'd like to send a special mahalo to our first responders and our fearless healthcare heroes. God bless you all, and this song is dedicated to you. Aloha, I'm Susie Schulberg, President and CEO of the Arcadia Family of Companies. As we all continue to adjust to our new normal, I'd like to say mahalo to all 590 fearless employees of the Arcadia Family of Companies 
who continue to selflessly work to protect the lives of our precious Kapuna. And from the Arcadia family of companies to all who are tirelessly working on the front lines, from those keeping our stores open and stocked, to our bus drivers, to our mail carriers, to our trash collectors and our dock workers, to our partners in the healthcare community, to first responders and frontline healthcare workers. From the bottom of our hearts, mahalo. Let's continue to remain calm and hopeful. We're gonna get through this together. And once it's over, we will definitely be stronger, better, and more united than ever. Mahalo. Let's stay home for our healthcare heroes. Hale to Hale, a concert for Hawaii's healthcare heroes. Mahalo to our healthcare heroes who is working long hours, long shifts, and then needing to go home and still take care of their children and their families. We appreciate you and all that you're doing. Hope you get a raise. <laughs> Thank you to all of you who are at home following the rules. You know, I really want to just drive to the beach and jump in the water, but I'm looking forward to that day when we are off of quarantine and how much more appreciative I will be of the beach, of just going out and grabbing a drink with some friends or going to a lunch, hanging out and just hearing loud noise in the restaurants. I miss that, do you? Well, one thing that we all still have at home is music. Oh my gosh, can you imagine if our house was quiet? Oh my gosh. No, I don't want to imagine. <laughs> this next artist is an award-winning slack key guitar singer and composer. That's where the money's at when you can compose. <laughs> Here's Makana. <laughs> Everybody's stuck at home, got my dinner from a drone Got my sister on the phone, says she feeling all alone Got no food inside the fridge, all them hard made me 
me sick. I be shutting down the borders like a World War II flick. I be chilling in my room to some motor spreading tunes. I don't get out of the bed till the late afternoon. I ain't posted in a week, I'm a feeling kind of weak. I'm a hypochondriac, maybe I'm sick or is it me? Hawaii is known for its diverse culture, food, and music. Our next musician is a multi-instrumentalist, an island-inspired rock and blues musician, the exciting Tavana. Aloha, everybody. This is Tavana coming to you from Honolulu, Hawaii. And uh, I'd just like to give a shout out to the, our healthcare heroes out there on the front lines. And uh, this song is for you.
I was blind, but now you know I see. Hey, welcome back to Hale to Hale, and mahalo again to all of our healthcare workers. Mahalo also to all of our performers and special guests. Now, we want to remind viewers how important it is to support our healthcare heroes by staying at home and following the state's orders. We want to say a big mahalo also to you, our viewers, for joining us. Now, as we've seen, music really brings us together. Absolutely. Next up, we have a well-known ukulele virtuoso and composer. And his wife is also a healthcare worker. Known internationally for redefining what an ukulele is capable of. <laughs> We're about to introduce Mr. Jake Shimabukuro. Mm -hmm. So on behalf of Pacific Media Group and Hawaii News Now, thank you for watching. Oh, and uh, don't forget, mask up, huh? Aloha. Aloha, I'm Jake Shimabukuro, and I just want to give a big shout out and thank you to all of our healthcare workers. Um, thank you for the sacrifices that you're making and all that you're doing to keep us um, healthy and to keep us safe. Um, my wife is in. Uh, my wife is a healthcare worker, and um, and I know it's a very challenging time right now. So thank you for all that you're doing, and I know we're going to get through this soon. Here's a a piece called Ichigo Ichie, which is a Japanese word for once in a lifetime, and uh, it's really about just kind of. Um, you know, being grateful for uh, all that we have and, um, and knowing that we're going to get through this very soon. i mm -hmm. 